All right, meanwhile, Texas Tech and ASU, we will be talking about this performance for some time, guys. It was very, very impressive. He's not, just, he's not just a man, he's a verb. He got, <laughs> when you get balaged, well, Texas Tech got balaged. Manny Wilkins, by the way, guys, looks, he was impressive in this game. Really well, ran the offense uh, well. Runs the ball when he needs to, and hands the ball off to the right person when he needs to. <laughs> there was only really <laughs> one one guy to hand the ball off to tonight, Kalen Balaj. Yeah, the direct snap and finding the end zone. And, 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 it's special when a player like that gets near the end zone and finds a way to punch it in, either through guys, around guys, straight on, just very, very versatile. Are we watching the same highlight over and over again, or is he just a little bit of deja vu here? Guys. What is going on? I mean, this was this was a, a highlight. Besides Balaj, just a ton of points were scored. 123 combined points, four shy of the Pac-12 record for points in a game. Got to go back to 1920 for more. Kalen Balaj, though, he ties the FBS record for eight touchdowns and 48 points in a game. Ties the record set by Howard Griffith with Illinois, who had eight touchdowns back in 1990. Balaj, those eight scores on 15 total touches. Yeah, and this shows you is uh, uh, being able to sprint, power. He has everything. He has the whole package. Balaj actually became the eighth player in FBS history to score four touchdowns in a quarter. 652 yards of total offense the Sun Devils were able to rack up.